Mike Dolce. Mike Dolce. Mike Dolce, my friend. And Dolce really changed MMA in this regard. You know, when he was coming through, like I said, we were teammates. We met every day at three o'clock and we were working hard. Dolce, though, he had secrets. Dolce actually came along and changed all. He said, you don't need to do any of that. When Dolce came in, he just had a very small group. Guys like me that were his teammates that kind of had an end to him. And then that group grew. But everything that we do to cut weight in the world of cut, all of it came specifically for Mike Dolce. What I love about Mike Dolce diet is just the flavor, just the pleasure of eating. It's not a diet that you suffer, you, you're always in a bad mood, he's always in a good mood. Mike Dolce was the guy that we had to have. He's a guy who we respect, we believe in, and we know he can get results. He's not some guy that we just hired, some fitness model guy to come in and you know perform this workout. This guy's the real deal. He's fought, he's helped people cut weight, he's trained people, and he's a guy who was overweight himself and has transformed his body and changed his life. Fitness guru to the stars, Mike Dolce, my friend. Hey, what's up, Good brother? Good to see you, brother. Likewise. Thanks for coming back here. Cheers to you. Thanks, Joe. Mm. Thanks for coming on, man. We got, I got a lot of questions. Got a lot of questions. Whoa! I mean, come on now. How cool of an intro is that? I get goosebumps. Although, I mean, what, what, what? amazing guys what experienced guys what credible guys to give me that that bit of bump right to to put me over to share their thoughts on what i do here and here today i'm going to share with you my secrets in weight cutting how to lose 10 pounds in three days and i'm going to do this very quickly i'm going to make this quick and easy and i'm also going to give you the free resource so you can do it at home i wrote a free guide an ebook if you will that i'm going to boom you can see it here i'm going to share it with you i'm going to give you guys access to this totally free look at this come on now free recipes everything is here all the science plus scientific citations to support everything that we're talking about. I mean, come on now, right? So let, let, let's briefly, and please, I'm going to answer your questions also, so feel free to ask any questions as I'm talking. What's the difference between weight loss and a weight cut? That, that's the first thing, because when I say lose 10 pounds in three days, you know, that is a weight cut. It's not necessarily a weight loss, but it will jumpstart your weight loss. And that's really what we talk about here. We have our three weeks to shredded program, how to lose 21 pounds in 21 days. The same program these elite athletes use to get combat ready, performance ready, stage ready, if you will. We want to teach our body to eliminate the excess weight. And let's briefly talk about, well, what is the excess weight? And what does this mean to you? Well, you want to look better quick. You're going on a date this weekend. You're going to the wedding this weekend. You're going to a back-to-school reunion this weekend. You have a big business meeting. You want to look your best, right? You want to present your best. You have a short period of time to do that. What are you going to do? Well, are you going to go on a weight loss program? Yeah, but no, because that's not going to get you looking crisp and clean and your absolute best within three days, within 72 hours, right? How are you going to accomplish this? Well, we need to flip a few quick levers. Nobody does that better than I do because I'm the most decorated coach in the history of combat sport who has done it 100% successful every single time. Okay, so when I say this, just take that into consideration. Forget all the, the, the liver king crap or whatever other mumbo jumbo the social media influencers are trying to throw at you. This is, this is where I made my bones. This is what I do. Come on, I bring world-class athletes to the stage on weight, on time, every single time. So when I'm telling you how to do that in the next three days, how to lose 10 pounds, up to 10 pounds, depending on how much weight you have to lose in the next three days. Well, I'm telling you as an expert who's done it for over 20 years at an elite level, 
Now, what I tell you is going to sound simple. It's going to sound too easy. It's going to sound like this doesn't make sense because what everybody else says is a lot of mumbo jumbo, primal ancestors and, and biohacking. And all of that is a waste of your time and it's a waste of your money. I have a free download I'm giving to you. A free download, a free resource I wrote for you. Here, take it. It's completely for free. Lose 10 pounds and keep it, use it, refer back to it. Every time you have something coming up, just go to the Dolce manual, the three-day shred manual, and poof, there you go. It freaking works incredibly well, unbelievably well. But that's the start. Because if you're at the point in your life that you need to crash diet, crash cut, in order to look your best this weekend, I'm going to very lovingly say, why not look your best every single day? Why not look your best every single day? And if you simply follow the Dolce principles, you will look your best. You will feel your best. You will perform your best. You will live your best life every single day. Every single day, you will be peaked. You will be primed. Every single day, you can strip off your clothes and let the world just like salivate at how amazing you look. They'll be so jealous because they want to look like you. They want to live like you because it's very clear and every uh, very obvious to you, to me, when a healthy person walks in the room, you're like, wow, man, he looks great. She looks great. When an unhealthy person walks in the room, we're going, uh, man, I'm glad I don't look like that. I'm glad I'm not that bad, but are you? are you? So the three-day shred program is a jumpstart program to look and feel your best in a short period of time to put your best foot forward, but it's temporary. And that's cool. Like you want to, you want to slim down and, and be that, you know, hot little, you know, what I almost use, I'm not gonna use bad words here. You want to look great on the weekend. Hey man, three-day shred is going to be awesome. But I'm going to encourage you to adopt a well-rounded lifestyle to look your best year-round. Now, when we talk about three-day shred weight cut versus weight loss, weight cutting is the temporary reduction of non-functional body mass to perform at a certain level. That can be aesthetics for you know physique, or it can be for maybe an acute uh, performance-based competition, like an MMA fight, let's say. Who knows? There's a few levers we can pull, one of which is water manipulation. We can make sure your body actually drops that stored water because holding excess water looks like fat. Someone who's holding excess water, you look fat. Nobody knows, oh, I'm holding extra water. Like, shut up. You look fat, right? Me on the outside, if I have excess water under my skin, you don't know if it's excess water or if it's fat because it looks the exact same thing. It's that excess space under the skin that blurs all the definition. You look chubby. You look fat. So we want to eliminate that. How do we eliminate that? We use a few different techniques of water reduction. And we use all natural techniques. We use a system of water loading, the way to actually drink the type of water and the amount of water you should be drinking that will elicit a weight loss, weight reduction, purging effect of holding water. We use a system of electrolyte manipulation, taking certain electrolytes, primarily sodium and potassium, not just sodium depletion. That is a bad way. It's the relationship of sodium to potassium that matters. So we alter the sodium to, to potassium ratio while manipulating your water intake. And then we focus on reducing the total inflammatory response of your body, which is handled through your digestive system. And most people don't know that. Nobody knows that. Nobody understands that. Your body, your digestive system, your body becomes inflamed systemically due to an inflamed digestive system. Now, if we can reduce the digestive inflammatory response, you will reduce the total inf inflammation of your body, of your face, of your ass, of your belly. All of a sudden, your abs pop out. You have veins. What the hell happened in just three days? Well, that's what the three-day shred program does. We teach, and we teach your body to lose this water through a multi-process or a multifactorial process following a very simple meal plan. And it's all meal plan based, right? We have a very simple meal plan. You eat four meals. Imagine eating four meals while losing 10 pounds in three days. That You have to. 
Like you have to eat. Now, like, forget about the 86 hour fast or whatever crap that is. It's so stupid. You're gonna go fast for 80 some odd hours to lose less weight than you would have by eating four times a day. It, it makes no sense to be fully fueled, fully energized. It makes no sense. Like, honestly, it makes no sense. So, point is. The three-day shred program is incredible. If you have any questions, I'm going to answer them right now. But I have a link below this video where you can download the free three-day shred program. It is to the Dolce Diet site. So it's one of the URLs on our site. It's an HTTPS, totally secure. You don't have to worry about it. It is me to you, right? We don't do, we don't sell your information. It's not some, some secret thing. It's me giving you through the, the safety and security of our own site. It's me giving you a free download that I wrote for you. Right? Look at it. <laughs> Come on now. The meal plan. Three, I mean, that's a three-day meal plan right there. Four meals a day. The recipes. The scientific citations to support the things that we say because, hey, science matters right? The three-day shred program. There's a link below this video in the, the, the show notes, the description. Just click on it, get it. And then let me know when you lose those 10 pounds and maybe you only need to lose five because you will be shocked. This bottle right here, this is only two pounds. Imagine losing five pounds or five of these in three days. How amazing will you look? Well, that's what we do. We do it better than anyone else. I mean, come on, we do it better than anyone else. That's what I'm sharing with you. Let me answer some questions here. Boom. D, what's up, my man? Yo, yo, yo. Fire, big Jesse Lee. What's up, brother? James John. Um, go pure liquid, LOL. Now, nah, eh, would not do that. Sam, what's up, man? What's up? What's better when looking at weight gain? Four standard meals or the three meals with snacks in between four. I would do four meals for sure. Forget the snacks. We're not little kids, right? We're not kindergartners. We are grown ass adults making gains. I just ate my meal, like a real meal, like a 400 to 800 calorie meal, four to six times per day where we want to make gains, real gains. Um, Shift, he says, I'm five days in the three weeks to shred it. I'm overweight and probably never, ever get shredded. That is not true. I used to be 282 pounds, 282 pounds at 35% body fat. I'm 202 pounds right now at 6% body fat. Okay. I have done it. I've done it. I've lived it. I've walked in your footsteps. Um, but I like to look in the mirror sometime instead of shaving in the shower, afraid of to catch a glimpse of me. Um, shifty brother, I got you. I got you guy or gal. Sorry. I said, brother, but I got you F stick to the three weeks to shredded program. Anybody who needs a three weeks to shredded program, go to the Dolce diet.com use promo code, um, Dolce nose to save 20%, right? I think that's a 20% discount. Um, and, and we got you. What's up young life. But I mean, just download the, the free, uh, three day shred guide, <laughs> download the free three day shred guide. I mean, come on, it's free right? Three day shred. Why not? It's free. Start there. If you like it, then you can upgrade to the, the paid three weeks to shred it and lose 21 pounds in 21 days. Um, are skin tags a sign of something wrong? I use, I would go to the doctor. Yes. I've, I've seen, I'm not an expert on skin tags, but I do believe that there may be not always, there may be a correlation between thyroid and skin tags. I believe I've read that. Go to your doctor, please. Um, Team, uh, what's up, Dave? Uh, team Dolce, the only team with a 100% success rate. Boom, and that is the truth. Just had the garden egg scramble. Oh, I love that. Can't wait for some summer. Bro, you are going to drop jaws this summer. You're dropping jaws this winter, man. But when you get to walk around shirtless, David is such an amazing transformation. Um, I, I'm good, David. I didn't do it this week. We had some stuff going on, but I'm going to post your transformation on our Instagram page next week. Everyone should follow, by the way. Sam says, if you had five to six hundred dollars spare each month, what would you be doing with it all in an ETF? Uh, so, Sam, I believe looks like you're over there um, in in Europe uh, somewhere, Europe or UK, right? But what I would do is I would be investing. What I do do, I invest in 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 
low expense ratio index funds or ETFs, exchange traded funds. I invest in the United States stock market, primarily the S&P 500. I have a few different investment options. The S&P 500 here in the United States, I would suggest everyone look into not financial advice. I would suggest everyone look into a low cost index fund that invests into the S&P 500. And I would strongly suggest everyone look into a Roth IRA, a Roth 401k with a company match and or after tax investments with your first $500 um, here in the States, but also over in Europe too. Brian, skin takes time to develop when the skin rubs together, such as armpits, anus, thighs, that happens. Um, not No to the ETF. Why? Eh, eh. why would you guys, Brian and Jay Foy, why would you say no to the ETF, please? explain please explain i'd love to have that conversation with you guys i know we're getting long on this video um yes to the etf over here yes to the etf dean says thanks mm, bum, bum, bum. luigi luigi what's up bro um hope you're doing well just having too much potassium push sodium out well too much potassium can cause a heart attack so you have to be careful but that's in excess it's the ratio of sodium to potassium that matters right? Having that ratio off, you're going to gain hold water. Having it perfectly balanced, you'll maintain water and slightly tilted, you'll lose water. We have all of that covered in the three-day shred manual. Omar, what's up, brother? Good to see you, my man. Back from the mountains, my mountain climbing brother, dude. Good to see you, Omar. Crushing it. Derek, what's up, Derek? Been a while. Evan, yo, what's up on the mic? Glad I finally get to watch you live. What do you think of Dana White's transformation with lifestyle intervention? Man, I love what Dana's done. Big picture. He got to where he needed to go. I believe he followed a less efficient path, right? I think Dana could have done this a lot sooner, a lot healthier, instead of resorting to a lot of the, the crash diet stuff, the extreme, but he's an extreme guy. So I'm super happy where he ended up. Although I do have some criticism of the path to get there with healthy criticism, right? Um, but I'm super happy that he's a much healthier version of himself. Brian, I'm the dad and caregiver of a special needs son. My time is extremely limited. What are some good, quick, full body exercise you would recommend? Body weight squats. Yeah, how about this? Everyone here, how about this? Do 60 seconds of nonstop body weight squats every single hour while you're awake. I, I dare every one of you, 60 seconds of nonstop body weight squats every hour while you're awake. You want to make it, a, a, you want to level it up? Okay, fine. Do 60 seconds of nonstop body weight squats every hour on the hour. Do 60 seconds of nonstop push ups every half hour on the half hour. What does that mean? At the top of the hour, at 12 p.m., I do 60 body weight squats. At 12.01, I go about my day. At 12.30, I do 60 seconds of nonstop push-ups. At 12.31, I go about my day. That's two minutes an hour. Watch how rapidly your body transforms. Watch how rapidly your body transforms. Heck, I'll leave it. Oh, you're too busy? No, you're not. But let's say you're too busy. Okay, fine. Do 30 seconds of nonstop body weight squats, immediately followed by 30 seconds of nonstop push-ups every single hour while you are awake for the next 30 days, no breaks. Watch how different you look. Watch how different you feel. Watch how many more reps you add. Look at the shape of your lower body. Look at the shape of your belly, of your torso. Look at the shape of your upper body. Watch what happens. Brother, I get it, man. Much respect to you. That's my strongest possible suggestion. We call those micro workouts. What's with the Gary Brecca hype these days? Real or fake? Fake. Fake. Everyone go and do your research on Gary Brecker, Brecca's criminal record in Florida and his arrest record in Florida. I have so many people who've been sending it to me. I haven't done a video on it. I feel like I should, but I'm not a drama guy, but I feel like I should. There is so much. That dude has been in so much trouble with the law sued so many times like you would never if he was your brother-in-law and asked to borrow 10 bucks you'd be like get the fuck out of here man don't why are you at my house get off get off my porch gary 
No, Gary, go. Nobody here wants to talk to you, Gary. You've burnt enough bridges, Gary. If he was your family member, he'd be like, get the fuck off my porch, Gary. Go do your own research. Don't listen to me. Do your own research. Jackie, what about supplements like Element? L-M-N-T, that is, hey, if you are too lazy to shake some salt into your water, then go ahead and, and spend 60 bucks on fancy flavor, fancy colored salt packets. I'm, that's the truth of it. You know what? I actually have... Ah, uh, I have a, if you are a member of my, let me see here if I can find it. I actually gave out, I can't find it right now. It's, I don't have the time. I gave out a f the free recipe go go to the dolce diet.com click on the blog tab inside the blog in the last couple of weeks you will see my hydration formula for free i gave you the whole formula for free you can make a better version of lmnt for free in your own house with a higher quality ingredient list and not spend 60 bucks spend like six cents that's better. That's the same one I use with these elite athletes. Go to the Dolce Diet.com, click on the blog page, and it's all there. I have so many free resources for you guys, by the way. Um, California, after I pay off all my debt, how do I get my credit to zero? You stop taking out loans. Stop taking out loans. No loans, no leases, no credit cards, no mortgages, no borrowing money, no debt. No debt. Sounds crazy. It's counterculture. But the borrower is slave to the lender. And I know many of you right now are slaves. You got to, man, you got to pay them bills, huh? You got to pay off all those debts. You got to pay the credit card company. Got to pay for your car lease. Got to pay, 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 pay. People who are charging you interest so they can drive around fancy cars. Um, John started TRT a month ago, gained 15 pounds, definitely getting on three weeks to shredded ASAP. Absolutely. Go to the Dolce diet.com. Start the three weeks to shredded and living lean. Start the 12 week program. You actually use the, here's a hack. Use the, um, black Friday promo code. Use black Friday promo code. It's going to give you like 20 some odd percent off. That's the one to use like sneak in. We didn't cancel it yet. Shh. So use the Black Friday promo code, save 20% on the 12 week, three weeks to shredded and living lean bundle at thedolcediet.com. Does three weeks to shredded work for woman with lipoedema? Well, I mean, this is not medical advice. I am not a medical doctor. So speak with your doctor before you start any diet or exercise program. In the past, three weeks to shredded has worked extremely well for women. Like one of the greatest female athletes in the world. Well, and many, I should say many, many. Zero or no score. Well, you go down to zero and then like me, you go to no score. So I don't even have a zero credit score. I have no credit score. I have no credit score. I do not even exist. They call me a ghost. I am a ghost in the system. They see that I'm alive. I have a social security number. I do not even show up in the credit system because I don't use credit. I haven't used credit since any, the last payment I made that had anything to do with credit was in 2005 as a three-year lease ended on my Ford Explorer XLT Eddie Bauer edition. I paid $439 per month back in those days because I was balling, making money. And I, I spoke about this in my the Mike Dolce Show podcast, The Origin Story, part one and part two. If you haven't listened to that, go and listen to that. But that was my last time ever having any form of debt. 2005, I paid that off. I had a penalty. It was just such a bad financial product anyway. 
And from that point forward, my credit score slowly dropped, 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 terrible credit, bad credit, zero credit. And after a little bit while, poof, no credit. So now all the vehicles I own, and I own a considerable fleet of vehicles now. I don't won't say how many I own or what they're all worth, but I have multiple cars and trucks and other type of vehicles. Every single one I purchased without credit because I bought them for cash. Because I don't go into debt, therefore I have more cash. Therefore, I don't pay interest rates on my money to borrow or to borrow money to buy things I can't afford. I buy things I can afford and I don't get ding the interest rate and I invest my money so I actually gain interest. I think like a bank. I teach all of my mentees in my coaching groups to think like a bank. So then we can create generational wealth like all of the bankers do. This, this Most people don't get that. They think I'm wrong, yet I'm in a better financial position than almost everyone who disagrees with what I say. Think about that. Do you want to listen, listen to someone who's just citing knowledge while they're broke? Or do you want to listen to someone who is the opposite of broke citing facts? I can answer more questions on that. Maybe now that now's not the time though. What's your take on cold plunge and desired temperature if you agree? Um, anywhere between, I'd say between uh, 35 and 45 degrees is ideal. I like mine to be somewhere right around 38 to 42. Uh, what's good? Alan, what's up, man? Good to see you, bro. Um, happy happy holidays to you. Sensing Oklahoma love. Sending Oklahoma love. Starting new where you can't wait. Bro, I'm in. Whatever I can do to help you, man. Always good to see you, my friend. Hope all is well. Love, 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 man. Love over the holidays. Andrew, Dolce, any plans on doing Rogan's podcast again? Would love to see that again. Well, if Mr. Rogan ever deems me appropriate and necessary, I think the best time would probably be if, if I'm Joe's booking agent, right? I've been on Rogan's show twice. I mean, that's an honor in of itself. So if I do go back a third time, likely the best time would be around a severe weight cut mishap because the world of weight cutting has gotten no better since I walked away in 2015. And I feel a moral obligation to open source my weight cutting information. I'm the most successful weight cut coach in the history of the UFC. I'm the only coach that can claim a 100% success ratio. And what makes that even more spectacular is I worked with the worst weight cutters in the UFC. Dana White would send the worst athletes in the organization to work with me, and they made weight 100% of the time. They missed weight before us with other coaches. They missed weight after us with other coaches. They never, ever missed weight with us. I mean, this guy right here is a great example. Missed weight. Literally, he missed weight. The very last fight against John Fitch, he missed weight badly and missed weight multiple times. And then we worked with him successfully. I think seven fights, perfect weight, made weight perfectly every time. And then the fight, the fight right after we stopped working together, he fought Jim Miller. He missed weight. I mean, come on. I mean, there's there's many, many others that that we could point that to. Jay Foyo says, I'm a registered rep for the SEC FINRA. Um give us more info. So what's give like what what's the fact? What information do you want to share? Um, I can't, I can't give advice. Well, opinion. What is a fact? What is a fact? Throw a stat out there. Uh, uh, J flow. Like what is the fact that would make people maybe not consider a, a index fund or an ETF? And I will say Warren Buffett, he himself has said the average investor should 100% invest into an index fund or an ETF an S and P 500, by the way. And only a very small percentage, a single digit percentage of investors should definitely not due to their proprietary knowledge inside the industry. Warren Buffett, when he does pass, all of his assets will be transferred into an S&P 500 index fund. I believe it's Vanguard's VOO for the wealth preservation and the dividend potential for his family. He doesn't have, he doesn't say, hey, keep it in Berkshire. He doesn't say, hey, keep it. I'm sure some of it stays in Berkshire or those assets will eventually be liquefied and transferred or liquidated and transferred. But Warren Buffett's multi-billion dollar fortune will then transfer into an S&P 
S and P 500 inside a trust. So, J Flow, why would you say otherwise? I'm just very, I'm cur very curious. Is there a minimum time for doing this list each day or longer is better? What list, my man? I'm sorry. What's a good avocado substitute? I'm allergic. Almond butter, peanut butter, chia seeds. Luigi, thanks, bro. Oh, is there a minimum to how long you should do lists each day or is longer better? 30 to 90 minutes, ideally 45 to 60 is the holy grail of the Goldilocks zone, I should say, not a holy grail. Perfect timing on this coach, three, weight, three pounds off of weight eight days out from competition guys and gals click the link below this video to get the free download of our three day shred guide all right our three day shred guide click the link below this video in the description box this is a completely free download that you can get at the dolce diet.com through one of our subdomains it is perfectly secure it is safe you're dealing only with us right? Go there. You, you have to like, I don't even think you have to, you have to like, there's like the product page, boom, you click on that. Uh, you, you press the download button. Um, you know, it's super simple. Had Brandy always been a runner or is that something new? She's picked up Austin to see the family app brother. I appreciate that. No, like she's like healthy, but she's kind of gone through her different phases. She was, you know, a little bit more, more, you know, um, exercise focused when we first met. Um, and then when, you know, she had kids, she became a super busy mom. She was just trying to quote, not be fat. Her words, not mine. Now that our girls are a little older. She felt like, Hey, you know, I really need some, a goal for myself. And she started on her own leaning into the running, right? That was all on her own. She started walking, then her walking turned into a light jog and a light jog started to cut a little bit more distance. And then we saw a sign one day for a 5K in, in one of these local towns that, you know, we live in these small little beach communities. And she's like, I think I'll try that. I, said, I think that's an amazing idea. What can I do to support you? So I made sure we made it this big family event. She went, she did great. She finished the 5K. She didn't know if she could do it. And a month later, there was a five mile run. She said, I said, I said, you know, you did so well in your 5K. I think you should try the five, the Belmar five. She's like, I don't know if I could finish that. I said, well, you'll finish. You never know until you try. Give it a try. You just did so well. If you can run three miles, you can run five miles, right? So she trained, she built up confidence and she finished that. And then she was like, oh, I actually kind of like this. I hate it, but I like it. And in that, she liked the person she became by constantly challenging herself. And what a metaphor for life. So now I think she's competed in maybe eight races so far. She just did a 12K, which is a seven-mile run. And it's not just a seven-mile run. It is a hill run. And one of the hills, they call it like Death Mountain or something like this. This is a how many? I think it was like 800, like from start to finish was about 800 feet in elevation. And any runner knows like that is, that is serious, right? That is a serious incline where one of the hills is like, you almost can't run up it. You have to like lean forward and almost like hand climb all the way up. How awesome is that? Right? Super, super cool. Sarah, heck yeah, Sarah. Love it, young lady. Go, keep me posted. Guys, anyone who's going to start that three-day shred free download, the free trial, take photos of yourself. Weigh yourself. Take photos of yourself. Anyone who does three weeks to shredded, take the before photos of yourself. Brag to me. Send me a DM on Instagram. Send Gabby an email. G-A-B-B-Y at thedolcediet.com. What's the one piece of advice to give to a rookie wrestling team to get in shape for a tournament? The biggest opponent they will face lives inside their own head. You must outwork your opponent, not on the mat. You must outwork your opponent in the wee hours of the morning when it's cold outside. And you strap on your shoes, you put on your jacket, you walk out that door, you breathe, you see your own breath, and you go for a jog anyway. 
you don't eat the pizza, you don't eat the ice cream, you fuel your body in a manner that will help you perform. That's what these young young boys need to, to do. Um, what's the one piece? I answered that. Pat Hulse, does fiber help reduce inflammation in this situation? Yes, it does, brother. That's why we are large advocates of fiber. Thoughts on taking NAC supplements? You know, I don't have enough information to speak confidently about NAC in a public domain. Give me a little bit more time to refresh some of the, the, the terminology. Because there's, there's a few um, catalyst events prior to the utilization or the expression of NAC. And I don't want to step over my words, put bad information out there. So give me a few days, maybe next Friday's live stream, I'll talk more about NAC supplements. Hey coach, I know you're not a proponent of this, but just wondering how the body reacts, fat loss, sugar burning, if you do fasted weight session directly after list. I wouldn't do it after list, I would do it before list. You want to do the strength training first when you have the highest circulating blood glucose and stored glycogen, because that's what your body uses as fuel for higher intensity exercise, burn all that glucose and glycogen, and then finish with the low intensity work, which utilizes a process called oxidative phosphorylation, which is the release of stored fat for energy instead of glycolysis, which is the release of glucose for energy. Glucose is needed for high intensity work like weightlifting and, and stored fat for low intensity work like walking. Sugar water, LOL has like 15 to 20 grams per serving. Exactly. Um, Blaming T or T for gaining weight. LOL, LOL, laugh my tail off. Come on. This is actually, it's true though. There are probably about a third of responders who start a TRT program. Their body will hold water. They will be inflamed. Now, I don't know about gaining 10 to 15 pounds unless he's maybe taking 500 milligrams per week. That's kind of high. But what I would say is we see this quite commonly. I'd say maybe half that. We'll see a five to eight pound rise in some of the men that we work with that go on to an HRT or a TR TRT protocol within the first month. And a lot of times their diet's not good, right? They're eating too, too, too high sodium, uh, too high fried foods. Like they're drinking, they're having dairy products. Like it's, it's multifactorial. So what we really want to do is before starting a TRT protocol with if any of our clients, right? Cause we work with Guys and gals who are on HRT or TRT or estrogen or progesterone therapy, right? So that's, we work with all humans. What we do first is we balance their lifestyle. So as they start the process, we say, all right, let's get your blood work done. That's going to take a little bit of time. You got the lab review, you got the follow-up. Right now, let's, let's do all the best things we can. Let's get your diet in order. Let's get your stress management in order. Let's get your sleep in order. Let's get your exercise in order. So hopefully we get this stuff under wraps. Now the athletes or the, not athletes, the clients working with us, some athletes, clients working with us on HRT protocols, male and female, we don't see that. Very rarely do we see any more than a five pound increase in accumulated water due to inflammation. Usually it's none at all, or it's like, one to three pounds based upon body mass. Oi, robot. What's up, man? California, you got it. Um, to think like a bank is to live in perpetual debt with low interest rate. Inflation will make your money worth less with any interest rate. That's how the entire countries operate. 40 trillion debt below. I don't know if I think you're taking my words out of context or you're not quite grasping the message that I'm saying. So let me be clear. We do not borrow money and pay back that money at an interest rate. What we do is we leverage our own money to accumulate interest through appreciating assets that also kick off cash flow. So our money is making money at higher rates than inflation. OK, the money that we earn is invested. And this is what I teach my mentees. Any money that you make must be invested. 
into an appreciating asset, which means it grows over time. So let's say you have $100 invested at a 10% rate of return. I have $100 today. One year from now, I will have $110. If you have $100 today that is uninvested at the current level of inflation, that $100 today will be worth approximately 92 cents. Okay. So we are looking for an arbitrage of interest rate in our benefit, just as the banks typically do, the smarter banks. Now, many of the banks, like when you look at a JP Morgan Chase, JP Morgan Chase, they will take your money. They will then take your money, hold your money. They will then lend out your money and earn a 5% interest rate on it. They will pay you 0.2%. So you give them $100, they give you 20 cents back. They take your $100, they loan that out, they invest that, and they get $105 back. So they made $4.80 on you giving them your money. We think like the bank. We take our money, we invest our money, we grow our money, and then the only money we spend on depreciating assets is then the money that our money makes. That's how the rich stay rich and get richer. Rich people don't spend their own money. They don't spend the money that they earn. Rich people spend the money that their money earns and the richest people spend their money that their, or they spend the money that their money, that their money, that their money earns. And as farther down as you can get that, the better. And then at a certain level of wealth, above about $3 million or so, then you start getting into other tax structures. And that's that's a whole nother conversation. I teach that in one of my mastermind groups for entrepreneurs and, and higher net worth individuals. But if you're not at, at the $3 million net worth level, that's not even worth talking about. And that's kind of these are there's our there are layers to this. If anybody's interested in this this type of information or mentorship, send Gabby an email, G A B B Y Gabby at bdolcedive.com. I have mentorship groups for people who are hundreds of thousand dollars in debt, like fucking broke and, and scared. People who are living like a decent middle class life, they got a couple grand, couple tens of grand in the bank to a couple hundred grand in the bank, which is hey, that's cool. You're doing good, but a couple hundred grand in the bank, you're still stressed out, right? super stressed out. So, and then people who are, you know, above $3 million net worth. Uh, we have a bunch of different groups for that. Is doing lists on an echo bike less effective than walking? Well, it depends on your heart rate. Is your heart rate above 110 beats per minute? If it is, it's not lists. Jesse Lee, any exercise circuits to increase, maintain speed explosiveness while one to two weeks out from a fight? Ooh, brother, one to two weeks out, you should be deloading right now. Deload, man. You're ready to go. Hay is in the barn, baby. Now you got to fight on weight, injury free. That's it. So, you know, a couple extra pad sessions, couple extra situational drills with training partners who are going to take good care of you that you trust. But right now, one to two weeks out, the job is done. Now, all you need to do is show up healthy. My man, proud of you, Jesse. I can't fully recall the name, but do you know of the janitor that died a millionaire? working as the average of general his whole career, but invested. Do you think that's possible? Yeah, it's super possible. 100%. 100% live below your means and invest the difference into appreciating assets that create cash flow. Live below your means and invest what is left over into appreciating assets that cash flow. Eventually, your investments will be kicking off the same amount of money you're making by going to work every day. That is kind of, I have something I call the wealth ladder. It's a system of financial independence that, that we teach through, throughout our groups. And there is certain mile markers on this tier. One of the mile markers, and this isn't wealth, but this is when you achieve true financial freedom. It's when your investments create the same income level that you are earning through your work. Now working becomes an option, not a necessity. And let me tell you, it's not that hard to get there. 
Imagine that. If you had a now, let me let me speak at you for a second. If you had a million dollars invested into an S and P five hundred fund that's making approximately ten percent interest per year, your million dollars would be paying you one hundred thousand dollars per year. The average American doesn't make hundred thousand dollars per year. And people are like, oh, yeah, Dolce, just, I just need a million dollars. Well, you know what? If you started saving your money at an early enough age, consistently living below your means, investing the rest into appreciating assets that also created cash flow, you'd be shocked at how fast you can accumulate a million dollars. Might take you 15, 20 years. But if you start doing that in your late teens, early 20s, and all of a sudden when you're in your mid 40s, you don't have to go to work anymore, or you can subsidize a large portion of your salary. Now you get to work part time at a, a puppy place, right? You can you can you know work two three days a week on, a week on a fishing boat. You can do something that you want to do, making thirty fifty k a year because you're already making another thirty fifty k on three hundred to five hundred thousand dollars of a, of invested assets that create cash flow. I work with people all the time that do this. Pa problem is your parents never taught you it's possible. Do you have a workout program that's slightly less intense than squats and steak? I completed that over the summer and it was great, but I have a physically demanding job. Absolutely. Send an email to Gabby, G-A-B-B-Y at the Dolce diet.com. And guys and gals, we have a private group training program about to kick off where you're going to be working one-on-one -on -one with me inside a group of individuals. We're going to put groups together of maybe 10 to 20 people. Everyone's going to get personalized nutrition and personalized workouts, you know, suited to your goals and background, but we're going to meet once per week as a group. And I'm going to bring, you know, all sorts of, of concepts and tips and hacks and motivation and do Q and A's inside this closed group. You're going to have text message access to myself and the team. It's going to be like a, a private group group coaching program. So we already have two of these filled already. So we have room for a few more of these groups to be broken up throughout the week. Send Gabby an email, G-A-B-B-Y, Gabby at the Dolce diet.com. If you are interested, right? These are very price point accessible to most people. And then you have the ability to work deeper and closer, you know, with myself and the team if you want to. But if you're interested in that, send Gabby an email. All right, guys and gals, I appreciate you all for being here. Remember, there is a link below this video for the three-day shred free download, how to lose 10 pounds in 10 days. This is a free guide, an ebook, call it what you will. I mean, it's pretty cool. It's very comprehensive. Everything you need, every recipe, every meal plan, it's all here. Look at that. Yum, yum, yum. All the science, all the tips all the stuff that you need, the three-day shred, lose 10 pound in three-day guide. Click the link below this video is my free gift to you guys to get in amazing shape. Um, I will be back. This was a late one today, but I'll be back again every Friday. Noon is when we try and do these. Um, I think that's it. Well, thank you all for being here. And until next time, boom.